President Biden signed the $1.9 trillion COVID relief package into law today. Millions of Americans will soon receive benefits from this massive piece of legislation, including $1,400 checks, which could arrive as early as this weekend. With federal aid on the way, Governor Ige says furloughs or layoffs are no longer being considered for state workers. Winola Morales has more. A key lawmaker tells me that this funding will also help restore some of the core service that have already been cut as well as hire more people to help with the unemployment backlog. Officials say Hawaii will get about $6 billion from the federal government, of which $2.2 billion can help with state and county budgets. It breaks down to $1.6 billion for the state. Counties get their own allotment, $365 million for Honolulu, $36 million for the Big Island, $30 million for Maui, and $13 million for Kauai. House Finance Committee Chairwoman Representative Sylvia Luke says the governor's decision makes sense in light of federal aid approval. And with the Council on Revenues also projecting that the economy will get better, um, you know, we, uh, we will not be using furloughs or, you know, at least um, the legislature will not be depending on furloughs to balance the budget. The teachers union sent a statement saying this is welcome news for educators who have been worried about whether they will have jobs or be able to pay their bills. Luke says the money will also help restore funding cuts to the sex abuse treatment center and other core services. The legislature is also looking to spend $100 million to hire up to 300 more temporary workers to help process unemployment claims. If this will help resolve some of the issues and ex expeditiously deal with the pending claims that the $100 million is worth spending. Luke adds that cost-cutting measures are still needed to balance the budget. The state borrowed $700 million to pay unemployment benefits and another $750 million to balance the previous budget. So consolidating positions to improve efficiency is still in the works. And those things are important because it will not just help on the immediate, um, immediate budget, but it will yield savings in the future as well. Manolo Morales, KHON2 News, working for Hawaii.